Hi, I'm Brian Lipstein, president of Henry A. Davidson. We're here today to show you how to measure for men's clothing sizes. Depending on the piece you want to measure for, there's going to be different measurements associated with each one. Most commonly, when we measure for a suit size or a jacket size, it's going to be based on the chest measurement. That measurement would come off the client's body with their arms up, tape around the chest, high under the armhole, arms down. Make sure their arms are down because the chest will be a different size. And then go ahead and take the reading off the, me the measuring tape there, 36 inches. You can go ahead and relax. To measure for a pair of pants, we're going to then measure starting at the waist and then an inseam, an inseam measurement as well. So arms up, come around the pant waist, making sure we're not measuring over the belts or the fabric. And we have 30 inches there. And then the inseam would come from an inseam measurement here, down to where the length desired there, 27 inches. That's buying clothing off the rack. When you buy a suit, it's going to generally be matched with the jacket. The pant size is going to be predetermined, and the pants will need to be finished by a tailor. If you're measuring for shirt sizing, shirt sizing, you're going to measure the collar and sleeve length. The collar measurement comes around the neck here, one finger by behind the tape. Generally, I would do this inside the collar there. Just wanted you to be able to see the tape here. So inside against the neck, one finger behind, and that'll give you the neck size. The sleeve size for a man's shirt comes from the middle of the back here, across the shoulder, and down the sleeve to the desired length. Shirt sizing always is going to be bought by a collar size and sleeve length. That's pretty much the nuts and bolts of measuring for men's clothing. Again, I'm Brian Lipstein here at Henry Davidson.